What's going on guys? So I'm playing a little fun deck of mine that I enjoy playing. It's a, uh, I call it Anti-Metafist. It's an idea taken from a deck that I heard about that a friend's friend has, if that makes any sense. This is my own little version of it. And basically all it is is 3 Bear, 3 Gorilla, 3 Gyohyu, and 3 Tenki, and 1 Tensu. Then the rest of the deck is... Uh, Veilers, do I want to Veiler that? Attack positioning poker controls again, nah. But yeah, then the rest of the deck is three Veiler, three Tour Guide, and a BLS. <laughs> oh, and three False Odanas. That's part of the anti medic effect. And yeah, the guy called me out that I have an effect Veiler. Alright, well I'm going to one bay a piece because I don't really have a good hand right now. Some Paduality. I will take the MST actually over the tour guys because I can't special summon tour guides right now anyways and I have two back row. Why? Because I want to Gyoku that. Unless if he has an MST to get rid of my Gyoku but then that's just kind of a waste on his part. You really didn't want me to have that back row did you? What was it? What was it? Oh it was only a buck of moon. Ah. Well. Sometimes shit fucking happens. At least I got rid of his MST, so my back row is not as much in danger. And I have a dark hole in my hand, so I feel pretty safe, even though I'm not drawing my engine that I would like to have. I'm not letting you have that shit. <laughs> no. Sorry, Genixes. Whatever the hell this is. Sorts of revealing. Like, people play that? For real? It's all good, though. It's all good. It's all good. I guess. I have another Gyoku. So, yeah. <laughs> I never really understood Genix. Not because I don't get it, just more like, I don't know. Never thought it was that great. You know, I'll let you attack for 1,200. I really don't feel like putting a Fiendish Chain on you for just 1,200. I need to draw a monster. I already digged through my deck. I mean, not a huge amount, but... An all right amount. <laughs> Give me a ten. Ki I need a second fiendish chain. I can deal with that. I just need a ten key. If I could draw into a ten key bear pop, I'd be so happy. Or a pop duality or something. To draw into a tour guide would be something. Fossil Dina, that'd be great too. Um. Yeah, I'm not doing that. Nope. Okay, sweet. End phase. Alright, tour guide. His gear gear is face down. I'm happier now. Why am I happy? Because tour guide into Zen mains, that's why. <laughs> Boop. This deck is kind of a staller too. Like I said, it's, it's literally about countering your opponent with every card, and then just going and then going for damage with bears and stuff after you get your popping. But you have to get your bears, and then eventually, if you can get your tour guides and your veilers off, is to go BLS. <laughs> if I can even get that to happen at this current moment. Nope, I just keep drawing fiendish chains. Well. You stall, you stall, you stall. This is a really bad example of this deck. It's never this inconsistent. This is <laughs> goes in hand in hand with sometimes Yu-Gi-Oh! You just draw bad hands. Even though I wouldn't call this a bad hand. But I've gone through a good amount of cards in my deck yet. And I've yet to draw any of my other monsters besides Valor and my one tour guide. Yeah, go for it. I'm not that worried. Go for it. You can special summon one dark machine runs your special on that card and face its effects are negated. So let's see, you can go for a seven, go for a six, or you go for a star eater. Which he might go do. Oh, Zen mains! Okay. Well, that's a defense mode, so I'm not really worried about that. End of phase. Nope. So this is what we do. This is what we do around here. I don't want to deal with that back row. So I'm going to go Gorilla. How am I going to go Gorilla? I'll show you how I'm going to go Gorilla. Okay, so... Ah, fuck. 
I want that Zen mains gone. So that's what we're gonna do. Oh, and he left. So okay. Um, we're gonna play another game because that one was a bad example. So hold on for the next one. All right, what's going on, guys? So I have another game here to try to test out my anti-meta fist, as I like to call them. Um, so far, not too bad. I'll take the Gyoku. And depending on what goes on this turn, I'm going to set set. If he special summons a lot, this Fossil Dino, uh, this card puts in so much work. Oh, Medolce, okay. Well, this is going to be a pain in the ass. <laughs> Hopefully he doesn't get Tiramisu first turn, though he's probably going to get Tiramisu first turn. Oh, nope, well, he's going to pot duality, so he can't this turn. I'm pretty sure, I don't completely understand how Medolce's work that well. Like, I get what they can do to me, but... <laughs> Um, I feel like there's a, a card that can make them normal summon at least twice first. But, I guess we'll see about that. Whatever, I'm just going to 10-key pop next turn. Or that's the plan, anyways. But you can never, you can never count on your plan. Dolce Magellan. Alright, another Fossil Dino. So, I could... I want Tanky Bear Pop, but I know he's going to go for, like, so much mass crappage towards me next turn. Especially with fucking Chatu. But at the same time, flick damage, I can get some searching. If only I could have a Tensu in my hand right now. I could, uh, I could normal summon Fossil Dina and then go for whatever, but, you know, I guess I'm going to do that later. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This card's just for either, but I shuffle this card in the deck, yeah, yeah. Okay. Select a Tensu. Main phase. Get rid of that shit. Special summon. Um, God, he's gonna go for something. He's gonna for, go for Angeli. So, I'm gonna go Tiger King. Tenki. His turn. <laughs> Probably a bad play to go for that, but you know, whatever. God damn it. <laughs> All right. You can switch some of Dolce Monster from your hand. Okay, match Alito. You can add one Dolce from your deck. Most control is to activate this card. Okay. I feel like I'm going to get raped. <laughs> if only I had an effect failure in my hand right now. <laughs> okay. End phase. Alright, I feel a lot better now because now I can set up. I can set. Mm, yeah, Cinderella to grave. I don't know why that would really matter, but set. Do all of them get? Okay, it doesn't matter to me right now. <laughs> he can't have that many MSTs left. I mean, he can, but come on. I'm out of card advantage here, and I need some. So far, though, I have him down 2,900. 
Okay, he's gonna do one of these. He's gonna special summon Messengelato. Or Magellane. You're gonna go into Tiramisu. Right? I feel like that's what's gonna happen. Come on. My Dolce's don't burst my balls. He's thinking about it. He is thinking about it. Void trap hole, come on. Don't, don't. I don't think he has anything else to get rid of this, so I, I'm just nervous because I feel like he does. <laughs> come on, man. What are you going for? Exton Knight? Because that, that would work, wouldn't it? To, no, we have the same amount of cards on field. Number 101, is that what he's thinking? <sighs> Waiting. Is he finally thinking of something? Yeah, Tamasu. All right, Void Trap Hole. All right. Finally, <laughs> Tamasu always gets me. Always. I hate this card. Yeah, you don't want to attack me. Okay. Um, I think it was on that. Yeah, it was. So that's that. And this card is destroyed by something. Graveyard. Oh, and he surrendered. Look at that. Anti-Metaphys versus Modache, Modache owned. All right, guys. That's both my games for Firefist. If you like this video, thumbs it up, share it, all that shit. I'll see you later, guys. Peace.